It's the Big Old Fish Show with Kirk Craddy. When in Bermuda, do as the Bermudians do. Gene Claremont showing off his beast of a catch on John Smith's beach. Caden Flagg with his 14-inch brown trout from Norton's Pond in Lincolnville. Just in case it wasn't exactly 14, he's given it a little stretch. Camden's own Henry Perkins in his trusty Spider-Man fishing pole. He reeled in this McGunnacook Lake bass using special 7 million pound test spiderweb braided line. Or so I hear. Maverick Sar may not be able to pilot an F-14 right to the edge of the envelope, but he sure can fish. Like a true Iceman, he caught this beast of a largemouth out on the Turner section of the frozen Androscoggin with his friend Cash Libby and family. I believe they are responsible for the shadows you see there. James has been a fisherman all his life and has passed on his love of the sport to his daughter Macy. Together they caught this bass on Southern Maine's secret pond. First fish alert, speaking of fishing all his life at just nine months old, Kanan has his first brook trout. It won't be long until he's back on the banks of this stream in Union doing it all on his own. Time's fun when you're having flies. If you've got a big old fish to show off, tell me your fish story. Send a pic or video directly to me, kirk.craddy at newcentermain.com. And for the love of all things with starting them young, please put big old fish in the subject line. And even though it makes all the word wizards pout when I say it, fishing is fun. Catching is funner. Tight lines, everyone.